Hi, my name is Steve Kenyon with Greener Pastures Ranching. This pasture here today is near Busby, Alberta. Uh, it is a kind of a unique pasture for me. I took it over from a grain farmer a few years back. One of the really interesting parts about this pasture in particular is that uh, we protected the riparian areas for predators. Now that might seem kind of weird, but my predators are a little different than what most farmers think about. I'm looking at the insect predators because we've got a lot of pests that come in in agriculture and if we don't have the whole biodiversity, the whole ecosystem healthy, then we end up getting a pest because, you know, uh, the conditions are favoring them. Um, so what happened here was really neat. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna back up four years ago. The grain farmer couldn't actually get it onto this land because it's a lot of low land and he couldn't seed it, so it kind of was left. So that was year one, it just kind of got left and you know, obviously a whole bunch of undesirables and all sorts of stuff came up. The second year we decided we were gonna graze it, so we actually added some seed to it and we fenced it. And I tell you that year, the, the fencing was absolutely atrocious. The mosquitoes out here were absolutely thick. Uh, I remember my wife wouldn't even get out of the car when we showed up here. My hired hand wouldn't come down here. He, he, he didn't want to come down and do any fencing down here because they were so bad that year. Partway through year two for me, year three of this being left, all of a sudden we had our first hatching of dragonflies. Because we'd protected the riparian area in them previously, dragonflies, there was hundreds of them, hundreds of them everywhere you could see them. And uh, mosquitoes were gone. All of a sudden it was peaceful to be down here and it started to, to develop itself. There was also on that uh, first year that I was grazing it, um, I believe there are no seums or something was biting me, right? I was getting these little bites, um, little marks, and those disappeared as well. So there's a transition when you're taking over this land and, and it's healing. And uh, the predator in that riparian area is, is very important for that. Uh, spiders in the riparian area as well. We need to leave that grass nice and long. Um, they help uh, uh, catch those mosquitoes coming off the water as, as well. The, the long grass is where the dragonflies can, can perch and, and so they can, they can breed. Um, so this riparian area is very important to me in our uh, insect management and getting those predators to come help us out. So that was a really neat observation here that we, we saw once we protected this riparian area and allowed this ecosystem to heal.